How we doing today, people? It's your boy Yang Samang back with another video. And today I'll be reviewing the Aari um, Nukin 360p uh, Z Fold 3 clear case. Ooh, that's a long title. Anyway, this is the company Aari, and this is the model Nukin. P. Nukin 360p okay uh, if you can't tell by the case already uh, it has a pin <clears throat> there is hinge protection and there's also uh, pin storage S pin storage and you swap those two pieces out you know maybe you don't feel like carry a pin maybe you don't own a pin and you just want the case but either way I'm going to show you how to do that all right if you haven't already, uh, subscribe to the channel. If you have subscribed to the channel, please turn those notifications uh, so you know when I drop uh, content in the future. Also, like, share, and drop your comments below on this video. Any questions or concerns you may have about this case, please let me know. Uh, if you're interested in this case, I'll definitely shoot you guys a link. And uh, we'll go from there. Uh, as most of my items, I got this from Amazon. Paid about 30 bucks for it. Uh, I think before taxes. So let's see if it's worth it. All right. All right, let's pop this open. I've opened it before, but let's see if it fit on my case my phone or whatnot so there's an individual hinge piece for your pen and the other one I'm assuming is already on it alright so this is how it comes out of the box there's your hinge protection here it's all clear case uh, not the best quality of material uh, the inside has a little texture to it uh, I can definitely <laughs> see this being scratched up in day-to-day -day use. Definitely a fingerprint magnet. But, you know, you're buying it for style. So, let's pop it in. Should be two clicks. Should be one. Oh, two. So, that's not an issue. Uh, as you can see right there, you snap that in on the top. Okay, and that's also how you change the hinge protection uh, to carry your S-Pen or whatnot. Same thing there. Okay. So as you can see, hinge is protected. You see the Samsung branding on your phone. There's the back. The back has a little tint to it. It's giving my phone like a gray look to it. But my phone is black through and through there's your cover out it's open on the side uh, a little branding there you can see it all right all your cutouts this is what it look like when it's open all right uh yeah it's a little hump there to protect your camera but i have a uh, glass protection lens over my camera so not really worried about that. Alright. This is how the hands looks when your phone is open. So definitely gives it a hump. Your phone, of course, won't lay flat. You know, because of this. Not a deal breaker. Uh, but for those of us that want to protect that hinge, uh, this is definitely another option. Okay, pause the video and pop the other hinge on. On second thought, I'm going to show you guys how to pop it on and off. Because that might be one of the questions I get. That's so why I didn't actually do a live so you guys can see it. So this is what it looks like. As you can see it's cut out for your pin right there. Alright, so it should be real easy. Just Pop it off. And 
we take this one. I guess it don't matter. Yes, it does. You can see on the top. Just connect the dots. Or two spots there. Okay, sorry about that, y'all. Little technical difficulties. But I was about to show you how to pop this uh, hinge on that carries your S pan. So, on the top there, you just match up the dots there. And snap that in. Same thing on the bottom. That simple. S pan uh, holder and protection for your uh, hands. Now, of course, it's a little, this is a little bit bulkier. Um, it needs that space to carry your S pen. Okay, let me grab my S pen. Let's see here. And it should pop right in. There it is. All right. That's cool. <laughs> but it's man. That's mad bulk. Mad bulky. Look at that. Alright. But, got your hand protection. Your clear case for those that want to display their color. And you can carry your S pen. Let's see how easy it is to pop out. Oh yeah, I'll just lay it right up. I mean, you can, oh yeah, be sure you push it in a little bit. Um, just slide right up and come right out. See right there, it's kind of on the edge. It still holds it in, but I bet if I turn it upside down or something, yeah, it slips right out. So, definitely when you put it in, just give it a little nudge. And it's snugged in there. But... Like I said, it slips right out as well with a little pressure. All right. That's cool. Just a different case. If anybody like me to carry the Fold 3, uh, you probably got about 6 to 10 cases, so, which I do. Actually, I have more than that. If you guys have seen some of my previous videos, you know what I'm talking about. All right. Again, if you have any questions or concerns, drop your comments below. Um, if you want the link uh, directly to it, make the purchase or just check it out for yourself. Let me know. I'll give you the link. Um, again, turn on notifications if you're already subscribed to the channel. So you don't miss any of my future content. All right. I uh, will be doing another um, tech you didn't know you needed. Uh, hopefully next day or so. Matter of fact, I'm going to show you guys. It's the uh, Vlogcast Studio uh, foldable light stand with the ring. All right, my uh, Mercury. Can't wait to check this out. It's pretty cool. Look like it's going to be good for traveling. All right, it's your boy Yancey, man. I'm out. <laughs>